I'm going to cook mushroom pilaf today for this recipe. I'm using 250 grams of button mushrooms. I sliced it. Then I'm using a little bit of ghee, one cup of coriander leaves, then one cup of um, spring onions, then one inch ginger. I finely sliced it and one onion some garlic then I have pandan leaves a little bit of garam masala or you can use curry powder instead pepper and some cardamom seeds or you can use cardamom pods instead then I have some salt and I have some masuri rice you can use basmati rice instead of masuri I soaked it a little bit about 15 minutes and some water to start this I'm going to add the ghee into a pan and fry the onions, garlic and mushrooms first. The oil is hot. Actually it's ghee. So I'm going to add the ginger. Fry the ginger a bit. Then the pandan leaves. Cardamom seeds. It will give a nice aroma into this um, dish. Then the garlic. and some onions and I'm going to fry this about one minute now the onions are well cooked so I'm going to add the mushrooms and I'm going to brown the mushrooms now adding the garam masala and some pepper At this stage I am going to add the salt and going to cook this again about 5 minutes. Now into the mushrooms I am going to add some spring onions and the soaked rice and cook this again with about 3-4 cups of water on medium heat about 15 minutes until the rice is cooked so I'm going to leave it on the stove on very low heat and cook this about 15 minutes now the pilaf is ready so I added the coriander into that and you can leave it for several minutes before serving for the coriander to soften a little bit and the flavors to come through and this is how it looks like this is a really nice vegetarian dish that you can try and i hope you will enjoy this too thank you for watching